Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to witness and bless this union as Troy and Mariah join together in holy matrimony. This sacred covenant of marriage was established by God to join together two people in love and prosperity so they might weather the ups and downs of life with a constant friend by making a family that is strong and joyful. This bond is not to be entered into inadvisably or light, but reverently, deliberately, and thoughtfully. Complete my joy by being of the same mind, having the same love, being in full accord and of one mind. Do nothing from selfish ambition and conceit, but in humility, count others more significant than yourselves. Let each of you look not only to his own interest, but also the interest of others. Troy has been thinking about this day for years. He bought this ring two years before he proposed to her. Who would have thought a DM on Instagram would bring us here today? For those that don't know how Troy proposed, let me share the story. Troy set up for all of us to go to dinner at Tokyo Steakhouse. With their family and friends there, of course Troy lied and told Mariah we were there to celebrate a birthday. While we were all singing happy birthday, Troy got down on one knee. Mariah turned and looked at him, looked down at him, and turned away. <laughs> totally clueless. Totally clueless. It didn't dawn on her anywhere what was happening. We all knew but she was totally caught off guard and we all yelled, look at Troy, look, 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 look at Troy, okay? Of course, from there, we cheered and congratulated them both. Mariah, you have patiently waited for this day as well, planning from when you were a little girl how this day would be, and behold, this day has finally come. From this day forward, Troy, you will never have to worry about that leftover guacamole on your plate and you will never be caught without antibacterial wipes somewhere around. <laughs> Mariah, this might be the only time Troy speaks from the heart, in front of people, how he really feels about you. Troy and Mariah had good role models for how marriage is to be. Dale and Chris, they've been married 30 years, and last night, we renewed their vows. Karen and Travis, they've been married for 33. That's pretty impressive. The symbolic vows that you're about to make are a way of saying to one another, you know all these things we've promised and hoped and dreamed? Well, I meant it, every word. Look at one another and remember this day and time. Before this moment, you have been many, many thanks to each other acquaintances, friends, companions, lovers, dancing partners, and even teachers. For you have learned much from one another in these last few years. Now you shall say a few words that take you across the threshold of life and things will never quite be the same between you. For after these vows, you shall say to the world, this is my husband, this is my wife. Troy, Mariah, remember to love each other. For marriage is a lasting promise of kindness, patience, forgiveness, and love. By the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church and the state of Iowa, in the presence of God and the witness of family and friends, it is my great privilege to pronounce to you, husband and wife, you may now kiss the bride.
said meet me at the fast food parking lot Not really looking for anything serious I just got out of a long term relationship And I'm not trying to do that again no. But he chased her down hanging out the side of a jeep Be my girlfriend, oh